Packers, Saints. And this was another bet you made that made me uncomfortable. Not, not that I'm going to take the other side, but uncomfortable. And you took the Packers plus three and a half on Tuesday night. And you got that at minus 110 at Ben MGM. And now it's at three. And that's such an important hook that you got. Very crucial. And also the minus threes are heavily juiced. There's a minus three at minus 130 on the board. This total in the night game, Packers, Saints, has gone from 51 to 52 or 52 and a half. Saints ranked 21st in total offense. The Michael Thomas ankle injury is blatant. Kamara looks spectacular. And you have issues to their defense with Chase Hansen and Marcus Davenport. Breeze, his arm doesn't look strong. They're getting penalized like crazy right now, and that's with no fans. I mean, they got they had 129 yards in penalties, and they can't blame crowd noise for that last week. And they're on the short week. Panther or Packers are scoring more than 40 points a game right now. Rodgers is throwing six TDs, zero picks. Devontae Adams' groin injury, they made it seem like it wasn't so bad and that he should be good to go. You backed the Packers plus three and a half. Take it away, Bebsy. Uh, I backed the Packers because Aaron Rodgers is in a war path right now. Uh, he looks like vintage Aaron Rodgers right now. Uh, so I'm, I'm putting my stock in him. Uh, I'm looking at these two quarterbacks right now. One looks old and broken and one looks like the, the player he was in the prime of his career. I like what's happening right now with the pack. They look good. They're, you know, they've got the the Smith brothers on defense that look great, Preston and Zedarius. Um, and quite frankly, Breeze without Thomas. Look, Breeze, has he's had a weak arm for the last couple of years. It's been hidden a lot because of Sean Payton's scheming and because of the fact that Thomas will gobble up yards. And, and he just... Uh, I, I just can't put any stock in Drew Brees right now. Uh, the Saints, again, they, they usually start the season off a little bit slow. Um, but man, this is this is I'm betting Rodgers over Brees right now. This is this is my my reasoning for making this choice. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm I'm still comfortable taking this this uh, this play with the with the pack. And uh, until Brees shows me that you know he can throw a ball without wincing. Then, then I'm just betting against him. Yeah. No, I, I don't think there's anything wrong with your look. I just – I'm not sure what to make of the Saints. And they're at home, and, and I want to watch. Kevin Garrett says Packers are down the lines 14-0 early, 14-3. I, I completely understand your look. And I know that there's no call on Devontae Adams, but from everything I've been reading, he's going to be in the lineup and probably look good. And it was just precautionary that he was not out. And they, nope, they didn't practice him, which is the reason why he's so questionable. But that's because they just – they want him to be sound. They didn't want him to get hurt in practice. So, uh, Dutch Boy Fresh loving that three and a half. Uh, what do you think about this total? This total opened at 51, now 52 or 52 and a half. Um, if, if anything, I, I, I like the under here um, just because we've seen – Outside of Kamara, we've seen the Saints' offense struggle. Um, but you know, to me, it's just there's there's nothing overly appearing appealing on this. I think it's set right around where it's going to land. These guys are professionals for a reason. Uh, it doesn't excite me. Uh, therefore, I'm I'm sticking with the spread uh, and the pack, and I'm I'm not terribly interested in this uh, in this point total. All righty. Pepsi got that hook. 